All right. Best of five, loser's final. Distortion and Frostbite. The boys up north versus jump on these nuts and War Guy 26. War jump. The first point's going to War jump. 9 0. So now we're actually gonna see from the uh, opponent's perspective how jump just nails you down those corners, the same constant corners, and it's so hard to get to. Distortion. <laughs> Doing a bit of a rompa dump there. We have one vote for blue, one vote for red. So far, it's looking pretty good for both teams. Pretty early lead there for blue, of course, but I wouldn't count anyone out. 14 points there again for jumping these nuts. Quick curve, very wide from jump there. War guy moving up to the front. Jump actually on the back now. Let's see how we can preserve the juice. Cross. Okay, distortion getting to that one. Probably gonna pass. Nope, not passing. Jump takes it right away. War guy at the top. Jump on the nuts back. And he gets the super and can't get that one. Wonder if War guy is gonna take the back again now. Nope, they're keeping on. Six points there. For the red team. Let's see what tactics they have. Some, they're doing something right here, but uh, like I said, they're both a very, very good team. So just because one is in the lead heavily, that doesn't mean that they can't get back. And well, we've seen that so far, especially in the match against the uh, Timpa and uh, Wolga. There we go. 58-25, and the first set goes to War Guy and Jump. Jump has a slide for that one pretty heavily. Distortion sliding as well. Frostbite trying to get it past, gets it past. War guy with a beautiful, beautiful wall ride. Well placed, well thought out. Eight points. Frostbite. Ooh, war guy not prepared for that one. He thought it was gonna be a wall ride. Jump doing the wall ride again. Like, the wall rides are extremely effective. War guy in the middle. Two jump. And they've switched now. War guy in the back. Jump in the front. Plus, not getting it around. War guy barely, barely getting to that one. Or, well, he didn't get to it. But he was so close. Uh, Frostbite with a beautiful shot there. War guy versus slide. Distortion with the perfect pass. Frostbite not getting the perfect shot there. Jump getting it around Frostbite. Distortion taking with no problems. Again, distortion. No problems there. Jump has the perfect. He has a juice streak. And oh, distortion just misses it. That's a huge shame there. Now they're only nine points away from taking this first match. Distortion and uh, Frost really has to uh, put in the sixth gear now because uh, this is not looking good. See, Frost by trying to get it around, jump. Jumping very aggressive aggressively, taking up a lot of space by the net. Frostbite, once again trying to get it around, gets it around, Warga gets to it, no problem. Distortion does not get to that one. First match. The first game, first game of this match goes to War Jump. We see the votes coming in. Antelope guy voting for the blue team. Very strong showing. Very strong showing. Right, so Jump has to slide for that one there. We have a lot of votes coming in now. We have four votes for blue and one vote for red. Jump getting a perfect pass there to War Guy. Ooh, almost getting it past Distortion. Once again, War Guy at the top. Jump on the back. And Jump does not get to it. 22 points. 
that's a lot of points for the red team. And then the surveys from War Guy. And jump. By quick curve there. And does not get to it. 16 points for blue. And another surveys. Plus five trying to get her down jump, no problem. Plus by getting it around jump. Jump now with juice. Nope, not anymore. Plus by just having a bit of an issue getting it past jump there. Distortion almost fooled by that one. 23 point now. And oh, beautiful, beautiful quick curve. 63 points against 16. And the first set goes to work. No, nope, let's see here. Boys up no. Nice six point there from Frostbite. Really nice kill. Ooh, distortion forced the slide for that one. Thought it was gonna come more up right, but it went to the right past. And a beautiful quick curve from Frostbite, forcing the guy to slide. Oh, bonking. Oh, jump gets that one after Wargay was bonked. Then Frostbite actually gets to that one, putting pressure again. Distortion with the perfect to Frost. And oh, what a shot from Frostbite. Distortion getting it up to Frostbite. Frostbite now with Juice and standing right in front of it. I think Frostbite thinks that he, he'd rather be far up and be blue, then further back with Juice, because he feels that he can put way more pressure up there, which is very true. Ooh, both of them missing that one, giving easy 19 points there for Team Blue. Perfect. Perfect passes from Distortion, very common here. Jump from Wargai has done a very good decision to keep Wargai in the back. I know they switched it up, but it's good to see that Wargai is in the back because that benefits them a bit more, I think. 43 to 24 for Blue, getting that point in, and another point in there, 49. Can they get affected by the 49 kills? Can they get past it? Ooh. Frostbite is barely getting that. Wargai with the super. Can they? Nope. Distortion blocks it. Passes to Frostbite. Frostbite takes it again. Perfect wall right there. Jump. They're not getting to it, and it's 37-49. And the 49th curse may be very real. We'll see in 7 points. Ooh, Distortion just getting to that one. Very thankful that it's just fairly game, so they just wasn't so fast. Distortion running up. Frostbite getting the perfect. They're now at 13 points, and everyone can take this. If Red takes this point, they win this game. If they don't, then it is extended. And ooh, very, very nice picture. 70 to 37, and it's extended by War Jump. <laughs> Getting right past there. Jump, getting that short hop, and a nice curve there from Frostbite. War guy prepared for it though. Straight down the line, jump on these nuts with the reaction times there. Poison War guy to slide, jump on these nuts up to the net, and I don't think War guy was prepared for that one bit. Nice shot, getting past distortion in the back there. Frostbite. Frostbite only throwing a white. Another super from War Guy and gets it past both Frostbite and the We have a blue thrown by Frostbite and a blue from War Guy and another blue from Frostbite. 
we're guy placing them a bit better. And just keep he just keeps stuffing. He just keeps stuffing. If blue takes one more one point here now, then they are 2-0 in games. And they do! They turn the tides. From zero sets to two sets, and they win. Two to zero. Next could be the final, depending on. Everyone's ready, and we are going again. Have the first 18 points of the game going to jump into the next war guy. And some really nice throws from Frostbite forcing jump to slide a lot in the back. Jump taking a bit of a risk there, it looks like, but getting the perfect level that one, so it'll probably work in the end, and it was because 34 points to zero, and it's looking very grim for Frostbite and Distortion right now. And it just keeps getting grimmer and grimmer by the minute. Very nice skim there. But doesn't really do a lot because they need to work a lot on the defensive if they want to get into it. Poor guy with the perfect. With another perfect. Frostbite catching the perfect. The super. Distortion passes. And there's a lot of those coming in for the blue team now. Distortion slides with for a blue. Poor guy. Passes the perfect. Oh, and the rope dope. And we have the first set, 60 to zero, and it's a jam. 50 more points for blue team now, and they have taken it. And they're advancing to the winner's final, the grand final. Uh, and we have War Jump that needs to take three more games if they want to get there. It's looking very tough for them to do this, but they did a big comeback against Wolf, Wolfa before, so we can definitely see it happening. 9-9 now in this set. Some beautiful, beautiful shots there for Frostbite. Jump passing up and keeping the perfects up, and that really helped them there. Storage not being able to get to that one. One point lead here for the blue team, and it's only 19 points away from the grand finals. Only a nine points away from the grand finals now. Can Frostbite and Distortion do anything about this? It looks very, very rough now for them. Any point now will give them the victory. A little comeback there from Frostbite. And there we go. That's the win. That's the nail in the coffin. And uh, we have a 3-0 victory. Very, very well played by both teams. And uh, Warjump coming out on top there.